Homes of Hope is a home where people with developmental disabilities live and are taken care of with staff that not only care for them, but help them to have good lives and happy lives and be able to do things that other people do. To be able to cr help create an organization like Homes of Hope, where residents could have a life with dignity, with self-determination, to be safe, to be protected, to be able to have community inclusion, to have fun, uh, was kind of a new concept and it was exciting. We had three children, a son, Stephen, and two daughters. Stephen was born prematurely and only weighed four pounds, three ounces. And in about 14 months, we found that he had cerebral palsy. Stephen never walked and he never talked, but he smiled all the time. And he was a very happy child and young man. As he was in school age, he became a part of the SPEC program through our church. And during that time, at some point, we started to think about what was going to happen to our children when we couldn't take care of them anymore. So we decided to look into that, see if we could make a difference. They should have the same rights as anyone else, and we want them to grow in their independence, uh, learn more life skills, uh, do activities that they choose to do so that they are more uh, self-determined in their choices and their unique uh, styles and selves. I like watch TV, make my bed, brush my teeth, uh, wait on my manicure, go out, right, shopping, out to eat. I like go, go, go on sore trips. We, we turn on sewer trips, get, get along with the staff. Homes of Hope staff have me helpful. Warms my heart, literally, when they're like, Sherry, and so happy to see me. They appreciate how our day goes on the days that I help out at the home that they're in and stuff. And it's just very rewarding and then I'm happy to do whatever I can to help them. I think one of the favorite qualities of Homes of Hope is the dedication of these folks that work here and how many years they've been doing the same thing and they, they really care about some of these residents. They just take all the worry out of my family's life. I know they have Amy's best interest at heart I think that's the most important thing. Amy's comfortable there, and I think it's just it's just a great great house over there, and, and they have good staff that really take care of Amy as well. If you're looking to make a difference in the lives of residents at Homes of Hope, please consider a donation through a mailing to the Homes of Hope office or going through our website to make a donation. Donations for Homes of Hope also promotes the awareness of Homes of Hope within the community, and you can't put a price on that. People need to know who Homes of Hope is, what we do, what our mission is, and that will, like I saw happen when we built our first house and with every subsequent house that we have either built or acquired, um, we rely on that community support and awareness of Homes of Hope in order to succeed.